Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Shimon from Droid Now. I'm today going to rant about Moto G. I know it has been quite a long time since I ranted, and moreover, when the last time I ranted, I had to unlist the video due to some reasons. <laughs> so, without any further ado, let's get started. So, all in all, Moto G is a great phone. It indeed is a great phone. It is the benchmark of the lower lower end budget phones. It is indeed nice, it has got nice specs. Overall, it's a complete package. But there's one downfall which just overshadows them all, which is the fatal charge problem. That's what I call it. I mean, and this problem, if your phone gets down below 10% or so, I mean, if it dies without charging, it won't power on, yeah. In the initial stages, you will see that when you just hold the power button, the LED, the, the notification LED light will just flash, and then when you pop, when you just plug it in, you will get a blank screen with the battery in between, and you will see that zero percent, and then everything's gone. You, you cannot charge it; it doesn't accept charge. Then so that's the first stage. Then comes the ultimate stage, which is right now. It won't even show you the notification light or anything. It's dead. Not exactly. So, after finding some ways, after hours of googling, not actually hours, it just took me five seconds. <laughs> so the only solution that I found is you have to keep the phone aside for like a day or so, and then it will accept the charge. The other solution is you have to try a more, a stronger power adapter, like the. I like the one on the HTC or any other, which is like 5 volts to 1.5 ampere. So that, that will help. And there are some more solutions like you have to press the volume down key and the power key for like 120 seconds. It's like 2 minutes. Actually, you have to exceed 2 minutes while holding these two buttons. And then the boot menu, I mean the fast boot menu or whatever it's called. But that comes up and then you have to choose boot, reboot, anything, and then you have to click it. So, it's a common thing with lithium ion batteries that they will get damaged, they get down to 0%. Actually, never. It's like, every phone, it never gets down to 0%. But yeah, with this phone, it's... I'm not the only one who's facing these issues. You can just Google the search term, like, Moto G doesn't power on, or something like that. You'll get the same result. <laughs> That's frustrating. And one downfall, I mean, you must have just experienced some day-to-day -day activities, I mean, you also must have experienced some things like that. Your phone is just going down 1%, 2% and it just powers down. And yeah, you have to charge it over then, right? But you can't with this. You have to be very careful and the moment it shows that the power is getting low, you have to charge it or you will just face the problem that I'm facing. So uh, I'll keep you guys posted on this thing. It's shameful. Seriously, such a great device, such great specs. The view will be coming out soon if it powers up. <laughs> so that's it, guys. Stay tuned. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you don't like this video, give it a thumbs down. We take constructive criticisms pretty nicely. And don't forget to subscribe to just stay tuned for whatever news follows over this phone, whether it powers up or it just remains in this state. And don't forget to share this video among your friends, among your friends who might be owning a Moto G. Who knows, this might help them. So, alright guys, I'll meet you later.